Welcome folks, we're back on the VIP series, and if you guys have been keeping up to date, you'll know that today is the last day of Imp's Adventure. And that means it's time to roll some dice. We're on 48 dice, which means we've already done Shelter Mission. If you caught the last episode, you will know that we got Unimax, Ithaqua, we got Flora, and Morax. But they're not the big things for this event. What's going to be exciting is this adventure package. That's going to be 10,000 gems, 30 dice, and a 5-star hero selection chest, which is one more Ithaqua, potentially. And also, guys, it's going to give us those dice, which are going to be absolutely loosey-juicy. Going to get us a load of progress. We're going to get a six-star puppet selection chest, hopefully the five-star hero selection chest. And if we buy that package, we should be within a very high chance of getting the light and dark chest here and the nine-star puppet selection chest right there. So rather than waste your time with flowering and floundering, instead, guys, today we're going to start immediately with those dice rolls. So let's do it. 48 dice. Here we go. Starting off strong with a six. Very nice. We want to get some nice big rolls or land on these mushroom huts as early as possible. So if I can roll a four, now I want to roll a two just so I can land on this hut. A one. Okay, tarot card. What's that going to be? Lucky card. I would have loved for this to come a little bit later, but you know what? I'll take it now. So here we go. What are we going to roll? A five. <laughs> Best possible roll that was folks because that five gets doubled takes us right there to the lucky hook gets us a lucky dice on our first pass that was incredibly lucky so here we go let's just keep rolling those ordinary dice and see what we can get a four amazing that lands us on the starry mushroom hook really really cool that one gets us our dice back so it's free movement we roll a one again that's just rude come on roll me a two let's upgrade that hook one again okay what are you going to give me this time <laughs> <laughs> copycat card oh okay so i guess we're rolling the lucky dice again guys we're gonna go scooting around once more back to there we get our lucky dice back and we're cutting off a ton of this this is this is kind of good it, it's a shame it's coming now because i actually haven't had a chance to land on either of these two mushroom huts so maybe the tarot cards can keep up like this i don't know but either way this is not bad we're making some excellent progress. And there we go. With that five, we have landed on that starry mushroom hut there. So progress is looking so far so good. That karma hut is annoying. Let's roll well, though. A one. That sends us backwards. That's nice, which means I can lucky dice for six. Cut off this whole corner and hop on the lucky dice hut. So far, so good. Okay, that one is going to fully upgrade that starry mushroom hut. Honestly, if you're going to roll a one, it better do something good. So that's nice. Let's roll a two here and complete this one. Okay, a four. That's not too bad. That four there is going to land me on those four star shards. Not really going to be too beneficial. And we're now left with, if I roll a one, I land on the starry mushroom hut. If I roll a three, I land on the lucky hut. So there's a one in three chance I get something good. This early into the run, I think that's the smart decision. So that's what I'm going to do. We rolled a three. Great. We now have two lucky dice. So those lucky dice can be used to upgrade Starry Mushroom Hut strategically. So I like that a lot. So let's just keep rolling our ordinary dice. Let's keep moving around. And I landed on that Starry Mushroom Hut again. Fair enough. It's not going to be too useful, but fair enough. Let's roll a two if we can here. A five. That's okay. So at this point now, I'm going to use our lucky dice for four. Because it will upgrade the little Starry Mushroom Hut in the corner. And this is the smart move, which is great. And then I'm going to lucky dice for two to get us our lucky dice back and just cut off this little bit of progress here. Awesome. So let's roll this ordinary dice. Great, I rolled a five. That gets us our dice back. And if I can, I'd love to roll a six here, but I didn't. So let's roll a five. A four. Okay, can I get the copycat again? <laughs> I'm so lucky. All right, we're going to roll the lucky dice again. Two fives. Zoom in round. This is one of the best runs we've ever done. Hands down. To have three copycats in a row? Bonkers. Okay, we got our dice back with that roll of a four. Seems good. That five again. Are we going to get another copycat? Okay, a trick. I think that's deserved in all fairness. And it sends me back six. Ooh, that was not nice. That was bad. Let's roll a two. Great. Now we've upgraded that starry mushroom hood. So far, so good. I like it. All right, now I'm just going to roll this ordinary dice. We're going to roll a one. So what I want here is a six to upgrade that starry mushroom hut in the corner. Come on, don't let me down. A three. We got karma hooded. Poop. Okay, we're just going to roll an ordinary dice to get off here. A six, not too bad. Let's carry on then. A 
five. Rolling good high numbers. That's what I want to see. And then we roll a one. That's no, no, not it. No, no. All right. A four is okay. Right. Let's try again. Let's get a six on the ordinary dice. A two. Okay. We're going to look at dice for a six then. Fair enough. All right. Ordinary dice is back. Getting a five. That's getting the, the dice back. So that five movement was basically free. Let's get the copycat. Ah, it's the, it's the trick again. That's no, no, not the trick. Five, no, don't roll big when you send me backwards. Oh, that's just wasted so many dice. Oh, oh, that's so, no. Why would you roll that many ones? This is such a roller coaster. Come on. What? What? No. I'm not allowed to say these words. This is a child-friendly stream. Oh. <laughs> wow. Okay, we're going backwards, boys. Four. Wow. Another one? Another one? Finally a five. That was so many dice for such little progress. <sighs> that was horrid. That was actually horrible. So now we're on 101. This could be so much higher if it wasn't for that. That really sucked. That really, really sucked. So all of that early progress you made, all of that advantage we had, gone. Kapoosh. Lost. <sighs> okay. Let's buy 20 dice and see what those 20 dice can do for us. Here we go. Don't let me now. One. Oh, if I see another... I'm so angry right now. Words cannot describe the pain I'm feeling. So I will just passive aggressively raise my voice. Although that six was nice. That's upgraded all our starry mushroom hoods. Finally. <sighs> Lucky dice for two. Here we go. Calm. Happy thoughts. You know what, guys? I'll put on some calm and peaceful music. We must get in the zone. Welcome to the Imp's Adventure, where MK experiences only good dice rolls. Yes. Let's roll the ordinary dice and get a one. How tranquil. And again, a four, five, a three. Good, good, good. The lucky dice for six. Huzzah. Let's roll again. Progress. Let's make progress. Five, yes, good. Lucky dice for six once more. Ha. Ah. Fantastic. A five, we get our dice back, excellent. And a three, it doesn't do much for us. That's fine. We still have five ordinary dice left. Oh, the karma hood, yes, of course. What is good must be good. What is bad must be punished. Clearly these dice are bad, therefore I'm being punished. However, that four is not too bad. We now have a one in three chance of getting our dice back, so I will roll the ordinary dice and we shall high roll. A six. Amazing. Our dice came back. Okay. Let us get lucky. Roll me a three. A six, that is fine. A lucky dice. It shall be. Now, we have 179 stars. Yes. There are far many glistening stars in the sky, but 179 of them are mine. And therefore, I must buy more ordinary dice. And see what happens. 
here we go. A six. And again, a two. Make progress. Go. Roll big or small. Five. Good. Look at dice for three. We are making solid progress now. Solid. Progress is good. Stop rolling ones, please. The four, not what I wanted. One, that was a terrible dice roll. One, wow. Actually, wow. A two would have given me an opportunity to move, but nope. We must buy more dice. I'm on 204. <laughs> I do not like this. So I should go and buy the adventure package. And because we will spend money, the good graces of the DH gods will shine down on me. Yes. Lucky we shall be. Clearly, tranquil peacefulness wasn't working for us. So instead, I'm gonna go 30 dice. All I need is 96 points. And I'll get a 9-star puppet selection chest. <laughs> 96 points in 30 dice. Yeah, okay, wish me luck. That's all I'm gonna say, just... Oh, one. You know what, that's fine. Because I can just lucky dice for six now. Here we go! Come on. Two! God, I'm rolling so bad. That three's okay, though. We get the dice back. Fine, yes. Now copycat. Yeah! <laughs> Let's go! This was the music we needed all along! Yes, we got the dice back, boys. Nice juicy six. Let's roll a three. A four. Ah, karma hut. Yeah, but the one is fine, because now I lucky dice for six. Ha ha ha. This is the run, guys. We're going to get that nine star chest. It will be the thing that happens. I hope. Copycat. Power up. Useless, but I'll take it. Ah, balls. Karma hut again. No, but that was okay. So now I'm going to roll an ordinary dice. One in three chance, one in three chance. Let the magic happen. A five, that's still okay. That's good. All right, here we go. Five again. Come on. A one. Copycat. Blight. Okay, good. It missed our mushrooms. That's fine. That's fine. Let's carry on. A six. Yeah. Lucky dice for four. Here we go. Ordinary dice. Four is good. We need above average numbers. Four survives and sixes, baby. Threes are not that. One is bad. Copycat! Lucky! Let's go! Come on! We have nine dice left. We're so close! Let's go! Come on. We got this, guys. Nine dice! One. Bad. Six. Yeah. Two. Two! Yeah! <laughs> okay. Guaranteed. Guaranteed at this point. Absolutely guaranteed. Five. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Roll of four! Yes! Let's go! Look at that, guys. Absolutely friggin' nailed it! Like a boss. Yes. All right. So we're on 299. That's what I like to see. And we have a ton of dice left. So we're guaranteed. We're guaranteed it. So I'm just going to roll the dice. Five. Okay. We get things back. And there you go. We've done one full pass. Mm. Let's go. So, uh, now, do you reckon we can get 80 and just get those 10 Heroic Summon Scrolls? It, it's not going to happen, is it? So we might as well just spin around the board, see what we pick up. Cloud card? Well, screw you, Mr. Cloud. Didn't like you anyway. Going to Lucky Dice for three. Picking up more free stuff. Ordinary Dice for two. Now, I've got this Lucky Dice. Let's think, what do I want? Monster parts. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six. There we go, monster parts for me. Cheers. Ah, oh, huzzah. So now, let's just weigh up what we managed to pick up. 
We got a lot of rewards from Imp's Adventure. We got our nine star chest and we got all our other lovely stuff. We got our light and dark chest. We got the material selection chest, five star stuff, six star stuff, stuff. Yeah, cool. I'll take it. Thank you, game. So yeah, woohoo. I'm now VIP five as well. Yeah, boys, I've spent more money. <laughs> woohoo. All right, let's um, let's let's go open this puppet. Ah, it's in a chest. That's right. So let's go pull it out. Hello, Mr. Chest. And I'm just going to grab it. Any, any puppet will do. There we go. And now let's go to Drake. Let's get him to E1. As if by magic. Whoa, 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 whoa. Did I not pull him out? Oh, I'm so silly. Silly MK. Pull out the nine star. There you go. So, E1 Drake. As easy as that, guys. That is some juicy progress right there. Enable. Thank you very much. Now, let's level him up. What level can I go to now? Level 260? Good. All right. So, we're looking pretty, pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. But you know what I'm going to do, guys? We got loads of gems. And we got a fair amount of gold. We're going to go upgrade our equipment at the Grey Dwarf's Blessing. That's a plan. So let's looky here. I can turn my 5-star armor into 6-star armor for 60 million gold. And 2,500 gems. Let's do that. ka 6-star armor. Nice. I also need a class suit. We need assassin gear. <sighs> 100 million. That's a lot of gold. Hmm. Good thing we have ourselves a chest that gives gold. The material selection chest 2 gives 100 million gold. That's a lot of gold. So we're going to get that gold. We're going to cash it out. Thank you very much. And with that gold, we can now get ourselves some fancy smancy armor. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. So we go to the forge. Go to class suits. Go to assassin suit. Forge. 4,000 gems, 100 million gold. Let's go. Assassin armor. Yes. And just like that, guys, Drake just got even more powerful. Powerful. So good. All right. Now he's going to want attack here. Yeah, that's going to be nice. Nice and aggressive. And he's looking good, man. He's looking solid. Those stats are strong. That's not a bad Drake at all. So let's take a look at the chapter. What does the chapter want me to do? Use the Idol of Blessing three times in the Altar of Trials in Brave Trial. Well, good thing Brave Trial is open. Let's go do that. We're going to smash day mode. Easy. Cleared. Gone. What do we get? Let's have a look. Okay. Dark four stars. Pretty cool. Not going to buy them though. It's just cool. And what do we get here? Ooh, Seer. Just in case we wanted to build Sword Flash. I don't want to build Sword Flash. Not right now, anyway. So that's fine. So instead, we're just going to pop in our team. So far, it's looking pretty good. We've got to go make sure our equipment is just right on them, actually, whilst we're here. So Drake, he's good. Amon Ra, you're good. Norma, I'm not using. Andrea, yep. Michelle, okay. We can upgrade this. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. And Garuda. Oh, ah, okay. In that case, yoink off Andrea. We're going to give the best armor to Garuda. We're then going to go back to Michelle. We're going to give her some good armor. And then we're left with Rogan. Nah, 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 nah. Rogan's going to get the better armor. And then it's Michelle. Because Michelle's the weakest hero on the team. And then Andrea can just have that. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. All right, let's go back in. Come on. Back into the Seal Land. Not Seal Land, sorry. Back into Brave Trial. Let's keep pushing some progress here whilst we go. So, Ammon Ra, Michelle. We want Drake there. Michelle at the front. Andrea, Rogan, Garuda. Beautiful. Monster is our Phoenix. And oh, that's right. It was Imp's Adventure, so we got a ton of monster stuff. Yes. Let's upgrade our monster. So, quick upgrade if we can. Fantastic. And let's quick upgrade this as well. So that's good. Very, very good. And also, Guild Tech. We might as well. Let's go claim that. So we're going to go to Guild Settlement first of all. Claim this. We're then going to go throw in a Drake. And we're going to send Drakey Boy in to try and push this as far as we can. Excellent. Very nice. And then I'm going to go mosey on back to the guild tech. We got 22,000. Not bad. Assassins, let's upgrade you. So we need to finish off crit damage. Let's quick upgrade this all the way up to 50. And then we're just going to do 10 here, I think. 
So let's get this up to 10. I'm not going to hold the button down. I don't want to overspend. And there you go. Just like that, we've unlocked skill damage. So let's go again. We're going to upgrade this 10 times. There we go. And you might be thinking, but MK, why didn't you finish the other one? Well, we're trying to get across to this bad boy here. Assassin Constitution. This is going to give more HP and more attack. It's just good, right? It gives good stats. I like it. Makes me happy. So we're going to go with that one. That said, I don't actually have enough guild coins to get there. But we're making progress. We're nearly there. Looks good. Alrighty. So let's go ahead. And let's go and... You know what? Should we fight the guild boss just whilst we're here? Oh! <gasps> Oh, oh, I'm not going to because I want everyone to get a chance to attack. And there's 23 names on here, but there's more than that people in the guild. There's 25 people in the guild. So we've got to let our two other people get their attacks in before we, uh, you know, I don't want to leave them out in the dark. So I'll just leave it as it is. And let's hop into Brave Trial again. And let's try and complete the Brave Trial. So there's Drake. There's Michelle. Swap him over. Put everybody else in. And let's do some damage. Here we go. So, we're going to skip battle. That should be fine. Nice and easy. No one's getting too hurt. Uh oh. Oh. Oh, they, they got hurt. Ah, oh, we beat this one anyway. Here we go. Smack. Yeah. Nice. And, uh, ah. Uh, oh. Well, that's unkillable. Um, sorry, guys. E5 Garuda and E2 Inosuke. I'm not going to beat that. So, uh, on our bike we go. We're not beating that at all. So, in that case... I think I'm just going to try Drake out in the Seal Land. Because I'm ready to build some Ammon Raws. We're ready. I'm just going to quick upgrade these bad boys to level 100. To have some baby Ammon Raws helping us out. Now, they need magic sources, guys. I don't know if you know how Ammon Raw works, but Ammon Raw appreciates a magic source. And are we about to unlock magic source? Is that coming? Is that is that soon to be? It is. It's right there. Oh, Great. Let's go get the magic source. So we're going to go back to the Brave Trial. And I'm just going to go <laughs> three times just to upgrade. Just because we can. And then we're going to send our team in blindly. We're going to lose. <laughs> but uh, of course, it's not that loss we care about. I just want to go claim here. And whoa, 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 whoa. I've got to complete some stages in campa camp campaign. Fine, fine, fine. I'll kill some stuff in campaign, guys. Let's go do that. Let's just smack him. Come on, Drake. Kill, kill, kill. Oh, look at him dodge. Drake the unkillable over here, guys. <laughs> nice one, buddy. Good job. Do me proud. Let's go again. Got an active skill from him. He is going to wreck. Just two of them are just going to fall over immediately when he hits them. Here we go. Watch this. Smack. Yep. Oh, good active skill from Amon Rabe. And we killed the Karim. Oh, yeah. All right, let's go. Attack this guy now. Oh, wow. That Drake just dropped. Yeah. That uh, Bade, sorry. Not a Drake. Although, it's amazing how hard Drake's debuff just hurts opponents. Like, they were dropping down so fast. That's unbelievable. And, oh, my word. We can, we can race through here. Sure. Sure. Sure, sure, sure. I'm just going to push through campaign. I'll see you when we get to a new milestone, guys. All right, there we go. I've pushed campaign to its extremities. That's not the right word, but there you go. And it's trying to sell me this again, the shard boost. <sighs> get out of here. I don't want it. You've tried to sell me this a million times. I'm going to claim that. There we go. Let's get ourselves the magic source, because that was originally what I was trying to do. Get a magic source on one of my Ammon Ra's for Seal End. But there you go. And it wants me to clear stage one in Broken Spaces. Uh, maybe another time. Not right now. But anyway, let's go ahead to the dark heroes. Yes, the darkness. And we're going to go and give our heroes the best stuff we can. Now, this Ammon Ra is the chunkiest Ammon Ra, so I'm going to keep her around. She can do an active skill round two. Baby Ammon Ra, you're going to get a magic source. So we're going to upgrade this bad boy. Just uh, with this stuff. With the dust. It should be enough. Let's uh, let's see. We're just going to put in these uh, yellow artifact thingies and then just top it off with our dust. I'm just going to keep doing that over and over again because none of this is useful. It is all trash meme garbage. So just put all that in there. There you go. Follow up with this. There you go. And the final time, getting this magic source to its highest level for the maximum energy gain. Yes, excellent. Mm. And there we go. Lovely. 
Also, anyone that isn't in the dark faction, we're just going to strip them. We might as well. So, yoink, 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 yoink. We don't need you. You're useless. These heroes are completely pointless. Uh, well, for Dark Seal End, anyway. Now, in the grand scheme of things, they're pretty good. But, um, it's useless in, in Seal End. Anyway, Baby Ammon Ra. Here's some armor. Have your magic source. Other Baby Ammon Ra. Um, have anything that gives HP. Nothing has HP. Okay, cool. Uh, Dark Arthur Dom. Yo. Uh, don't really have anything for you. Sorry. Let's go to the bag. No, not the bag. Nay, we need three star heroes, of which we have none. This little fella, get him out. And I'm gonna give him just equipment. There you go. Now, I'm gonna upgrade this Ghost of Aspen because I can. And I'm gonna do the same with the Dark Arthur Null, actually. Just so I have some power. Just so I can do something. I don't know. We might win, we might lose. Who cares? We're just going to lock down these heroes. And we're going to send them into the Seal Land. Because we might beat Seal Land 6. You never know. This could be a complete failure. Waste of time. But I'm willing to gamble. So here we go, folks. Let's give it a try. Amon Ra's Drake. And a DA and a Ghost of Aspen. Let's do this. Here we go. Good luck, Drake. Let's see if you do this. Right. Amon Ra's have got their bubbles up. They give us some measure of protection. We've lost to Dark Arthur Null. And... Ha! Huh. Okay. Now we're left with just Drake. Although that probably did buy him the time he needs to win. Oh, go on, Drakey boy! No! Oh, that was so close, man. Right, let's try again. Let's try again. We got nine more tries. We're definitely beating this. This is going down. Come on. Oh, no. Come on, Drake. Don't die. Just dodge more. Just high roll the dodges, Drake. Ah, you got stunned? Ah, useless, man. Right, just dodge everything. Okay, no, he, he didn't. It's just a high roll. We just gotta dodge everything and we're fine. So come on, Drake. You got this. Right, bubbles are up. Okay, DA lived. Ooh, wow. I was not expecting that. And then the big bad dragon killed everybody. That's not nice. All right, active skill from Drake. Excellent. Uh, the big bad dragon better die. It needs to die. Oh, it's still... How is it still alive? Oh my goodness me. Now it's just a 1v1. All right, Drake... Oh, ho! Drake's dodging everything. Oh, yes, boys. There we go. Nice. Let's go with wave seven. Have I got a baby carry? Nope. If I did, I'd be using it. All right, come on, Drake. Dodge everything. Never get hit. He's the king of seal land if he never gets hit. He can beat any seal land. That's a lie, actually. They can out-heal him, I think. Oh. Okay, to be fair, he was dodging absolutely everything. And then the final time he did get hit, he died. So, conclusion of this is Drake needs to high roll everything. Literally everything. If we even stand a chance of him doing this. Although there may be a possibility. You never know. Oh, he got stunned. Ah, that's bad. That's bad. Pretty sure when he's stunned, dodging becomes a lot trickier. In fact, it might even be impossible. I think it is impossible, actually. But hey, there you go. Oh, we didn't get as many Amon Ra bubbles on him. That's a shame. Oh, yeah, he's super dead. He's super dead. Oh, he lived another round? Well, that's cute. Now he's dead. All right. Come on, Drake. Okay, okay, this is working. It's working. Good, good. We've killed two of them. We're... Oh, oh yes! Come on, Drake. Let's go! Yo, no! What? No! Did you see those dodges, boys? That was so good. That was so good. Drake, what a dude. He's already managed to get to Seal Land 7. Cleared. Done. Easy. He is doing this effortlessly. I mean, I, I'm speechless. What a dude. Like, he's E1. The monster's not even upgraded that far. Like, he is so good at Seal Land, it's unbelievable. And thanks for the cheer, Kepler. Much appreciated. So yeah, 
Do we try Seal Land 8? Oh, go on. We might as well. We've got two more attempts. If he just dodges everything, we're sorted. It's just the same deal every time, man. Just good dodges, happy times. Okay, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I think he's a little bit out of his depth for this one. He doesn't even have max guild tech. There is so much he doesn't have that I'm just impressed he's able to do this as an E1 hero. Oh, now he got stunned. That's bad. Yeah, no chance. No chance, but there you go, guys. He managed to do Seal and 7. I am not complaining about that one. Very impressive stuff. Great hero. All right, let's send him into the Tower of Oblivion. Let's see if he can get past this Walter Wave. He might be able to do it. You never know. He's got new assassin gear now. He's been given E1 enables. He's got more levels. He's just a stronger hero. He's even got more guild tech than he did last time he faced this. So let's see what Drakey can do to these Walters. All right, he's dodging a bit better. That's nice. Not that any of the upgrades we've given him improves his dodge chance. We're just high rolling. Great. He's just showing off. Okay, now he gets stunned. That's bad. Yeah, if anything's going to break Drake, it's the stun. So as long as he dodges everything, this is fine. So good luck to him. We're surviving. That's nice. Just wake up, Drake. Wake, wait, wait. Okay, they stun locked us. Okay, okay. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, ha, 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 ha. I've just realized all of our equipment is still on our dark heroes. Yeah, let's go get that back. Let's be smart about this. And let's think. What do we want to run on our team? We want Amon Ra, for sure. And this Amon Ra is getting magic source. That's good. So we got Drake, Amon Ra. We want Rogan. We definitely want Rogan. And then we want literally anybody else. So I could run an Ignis. What does Ignis' passive give? 30 energy and 20% control immunity. It's not actually very good. 5-star Ignis kind of sucks. So another Amon Ra maybe? That's not a bad idea. Let's do that. Let's throw in another Amon Ra. And another one. Two of them. Why not? Let's go crazy. Let's go wild. And I'll even go two and two split with this just so they stay alive. Let's be extra clever about this. So there you go. More HP for our Amon Ra's. So Amon Ra, Amon Ra, Amon Ra, Rogan, Drake, and probably Michelle for the CC. Let's see what happens. So we're taking out Garuda. We're taking out Andrea. We're putting in two more Amon Ra's. Michelle goes back on the front. In fact, you know what? No, it's Walters. So Amon Ra goes on the front. Let's see what happens. Here we go. So we get our Amon Ra active skill nice and early, which is really nice. And it just gives our heroes a little bit more protection. Super useful. Oh, Amon Ra gets bubbles off again. That's really nice. And that Petrify on those Walters, super clutch. Oh, what a win. Super duper easy, guys. Nice. Let's skip through this then and see how far we go. Alrighty, we were bested by this here team. I think it's the Starlight here that's the problem. So we just need Drake to dodge the Starlight active skill. And we're good. That will just kill Starlight super early. Everything else here doesn't seem like a threat. Maybe Demon Hunter could be a threat. But I doubt that. Alright, Drake's alive. He's living. He's got an active skill here as well. Ooh, that did hit the Starlight. Is it going to kill her? Yes, there we go. Now we just got to focus on Demon Hunter... She dead. And let's just carry on. What are we fighting now? Here we go. Ooh, it's a Margaret wave. Karim, Lord Balrog, Queen as well. I think this should be pretty easy. We're going to mince through these. Oh, yeah. Easy. No problem at all. Drake's got an active skill there. Very nice. Uh-oh, don't die, Drake. Ooh, he did. Okay, let's try again. Let's try again. Come on, Drake. Okay, keep dodging, Drake. You got this, buddy. Uh-oh, uh-oh. 
Oh, he might be able to do this. He's got an active skill. It's going to be a close one. Oh, yes. Absolutely nailed it. All right, let's go back and skip. See how far we can go. Assuming we can beat this one. Yes, we can. Nice. All right, we just got beaten by some Asmodels and Dark Arthur dolls. Not a fan. So if Drake can just dodge all the Asmodels, that's going to be super useful. Uh, uh, mm. We might need to move Drake further back. That said, it could have just been a bad run, and we'll just see what happens. Because with some good dodges, Drake's going to be fine. Oh yeah, super good. No problem at all. Easy cleanup from Drake there. Very nice. Alright, let's skip through all these now. And we've been bested by Aiden's. Oh, Drake's nemesis is true damage. And Aiden brings it in its plenty. Every time an Aiden dies, we take damage. Which really sucks. So each Aiden we kill is going to hurt Drake. Yep. I don't think we can beat this one. I think we might need a Garuda to clear this. Or just anything with healing. This is bad. Yeah, every time an Aiden drops, we lose too much health. Yep. No way Drake's going to clear this one. I think we're going to be stuck on this for some time. But that is wave 403, which isn't bad. Where does that put us on the leaderboard right now? Uh, anywhere I can see? No, there's a load of people in the 500s. But you know what? We're chasing them. We're getting there. Not too shabby. And no, I don't want to buy a light and dark hero selection chest. Get out of here. But all in all, guys, I think that went pretty well. We've got to try Broken Spaces at some point to make this chapter happy. But I'll wait until our Drake gets a little bit more uh, spicy before we try that. But yeah, I'm looking forward to the progress we make. Actually, what's coming? We got any six-star puppets inbound? Pretty sure that's uh, that's on the table, right? We got some six-star puppet chests. Yeah, got to bear that in mind, actually. So we'll try Broken Spaces next time, I think. And just try and push a little more progress there. But until then, guys, I think we are done here. This has been an absolute blast. We've got ourselves an E1 Drake. We absolutely smashed it in Imp's Adventure. And we've made more progress in Seal Land. We pushed a little bit of Brave Trial before getting slapped in the face by a bunch of E5s. And Tower of Oblivion is now in the 400s. So all in all, guys, I think that was pretty good. If you want to catch more content like this, be sure to subscribe. And if you want to keep up to date with the VIP series as it comes and goes, be sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel. If you want to catch these things live, join us at twitch.tv forward slash mkxjump. And that's where I will see you next, hopefully with some more streams. Until next time, though, guys, I wish you all the best and happy island.